In this modern age, there are few professions that we can truly say have been around since the beginning of civilized times. For example, there was a little outcry for social media influencers or podcasters back in the Middle Ages. However, one profession that has stood the best of time is agriculture. The need to produce crops and keep livestock is always going to be present within our society. So it goes without saying, if you want job security, farming is the way to go. However, farming has changed over the last few decades and technology has a huge role to play in this shift. One of the largest changes has been the introduction of agricultural drones. These technological marvels automate and galvanize the agricultural sector, allowing for more productivity and growth to occur. Don't get us wrong, it's still a grueling, hands-on job. However, these advances do help make things easier. So with that in mind, we want to give you the lowdown on these devices and show you why they are an essential tool for any farmer worth their stock. Also, be sure to subscribe to our channel if you want to see more interesting content like this. What are agricultural drones? Agricultural drones are not unlike the drones that you may have seen available online or in non-specific electronic stores. They fly through the air, can be controlled by anyone that is within range of the device and they have cameras fitted so you can see where you are flying, take pictures and videos. However, agricultural drones have some more specific features that make them perfect for tending to duties on the farm. These machines are commonly used for crop scouting where the drone will report any issues with the growing crops. Automated spraying of crops, meaning that farmers don't need to water or fertilize their crops, freeing them up to attend other important duties. Plus, the drone can be programmed to scout out fertile soil so that the farmer knows where to plant their next set of crops. All these jobs require specific drones. However, considering the time and money you can save in the long term, even one of these devices would be a sound investment. Which agricultural drones are the best? It is widely known within the community of farmers that utilize drones that no one drone is really better than another. All of these drones are of the highest quality, do the same job and the only real difference is the UAV setting that allows the device to geographically navigate your farmstead and do its job. However, it is important to distinguish that there are only a handful of trusted drones that would be considered agricultural drones. These are the Drone 4 Agro V3, the Agris T16, the EB Square, and the Quantix Mapper. So, if you decide to pick up any of these, you could be on to a winner. What country uses agricultural drones most? This is a tricky question to answer as there are many pending legal changes in a number of countries regarding the use of agricultural drones. With 15 countries outlawing their use altogether. However, there are a number of countries that are embracing this technology nonetheless. The first country to path the way for this type of new age farming was Switzerland back in 2019. Then since then, France has also championed the use of drones with agriculture and both China and the UK have very recently shown great interest in this brand of precision farming. Other countries that use this modern farming method include Australia, New Zealand, and many parts of the USA. Can anyone get an agricultural drone? In theory yes, anyone can have one of these devices. However, there are two key barriers. One is the prices most of these devices will set you back about $15,000 to $25,000. Plus, all those that have one of these devices will need to register their aircraft, fly within the rules and regulations set by the FAA, Federal Aviation Administration, and the owner will also have to pass a flight exam to be deemed capable of flying this aircraft. So in theory anyone could have one of these aircraft, but you'll have to jump through some hoops to get one and use it as intended. So that is our rundown on agricultural drones, what they are and how they are changing the face of agriculture as we know it. What do you make of the technology? Do you think this is the future of farming? Do you think that this practice is a dangerous one? Or do you just think the old ways are better? Let us know in the comments section below and don't forget to subscribe for more content like this. As always, thank you for watching.